In Iowa news, senators are advancing a bill to try and help the Perry District get back on track after a tragic school shooting left two dead back in January. State House reporter Skylar Talal dives into how the bill would help keep teachers at the school. Following the January school shooting at Perry High School, lawmakers are trying to help the district retain teachers. Senators are now moving forward with a proposal that would allow Perry schools to dip into their management levy to give teachers retention bonuses for staying. Under the bill, Perry schools couldn't use more than $700,000 for those bonuses, and they can't raise the levy to replenish the funds. Senate Dem Herman Kornbach supports the bill, but would like the state to direct more money to Perry as well. I would prefer to see the state uh, come up with uh, some additional state money to help the Perry District rather than having them divert funds that, for which they may have other local uses. The Iowa Association of School Boards is working to help the Perry District get back on track, telling lawmakers the district is also taking advice from other schools across the country with similar school shooting experiences, which is why the bill also proposes waiving some class assessments for students, graduation requirements, and the required number of school days and hours. First and foremost, they learned very quickly that learning loss, uh, learning is very challenging for several months after an incident and we've heard some um, anecdotal stories just from the school board and the superintendent about students that have been struggling. Along with the tragic school shooting, the community is also now dealing with Tyson Foods closing their pork plant, which is Perry's largest employer. Senate Dems are proposing extending unemployment benefits back to 39 weeks instead of 16 to help with the job loss. It's compounded, of course, by the plant closing in Perry. Uh, it's kind of the double whammy. Um, uh, we should certainly consider all different forms of uh, help for that community, including extending further unemployment benefits. In Des Moines, Skyler Talal reporting.